time for the Bias Sports Report. Huge upset in uh, hockey today. Canada beat by Slovakia in Helsinki. Captain Ryan Getzlav led by example, taking a stupid penalty late in the third, giving Slovakia a power play on which they scored the winning goal. Well done, Getzlav. Right on. Here's Coach Brent Sutter after the game. Somebody got to ask a question. Stand there and look at me. We lost. Yeah, you did. Hey, you know what? Oiler fan? That's who they want as your new head coach. <laughs> Brent Sutter? That's who they want. It's true. They let go Rennie today. I'd love to see Brent Sutter coach the Oilers. That'd be great. Rangers coach John Tortorella benched Marion Gabrick last night in the third period after a couple bad plays. Torts, uh, can you talk about the benching of Gabrick last night? No, I'm going to keep it in the room. Is this the kind of effort your team needs to win a series? No, I'm going to keep it in the room. Are there any areas you need to improve on? No, I'm going to keep it in the room. I mean, I'm trying to ask some questions here, and you're not even answering me. What about you, Brian Burke? Will you answer some questions? What areas do you think the Rangers need to improve in? I think it's an ignorant question. And a gutless one, too. Like, seriously. These guys won't answer any questions. Brent Sutter, can you answer the question? Somebody can ask a question. Just stand there and look at me. We lost. I just asked him a question. He's not even listening to me. This is unbelievable. These coaches are out of control. Chicago's ABC affiliate, WLS... Described Ron Artest, a.k.a. World Meta Peace or Meta World Peace or whatever his name is, as Lakers idiots in a graphic last night after the game. Uh-oh. Well, I mean, he is an idiot. There's no disputing that. I mean, because he is the guy who said this. Happy uh, that Jesus Christ um, did not let me lose my teeth when I was 20 years old. Because I was wondering, like, what if you kept your baby teeth until the age of 18 or 20 and then you lose them? That would look pretty bad. So I'm, I just think he's really brilliant that you lose your teeth when you're a baby rather than lose it when you're like 30 or 20. He's got a good point, actually. I don't know why Chicago feel it's, it's their place to make fun of. The Bulls aren't even in the playoffs anymore. They're not playing the Lakers. This isn't Magic versus Jordan. I mean, it's only ABC who owns ESPN. And you know ESPN's not supposed to be biased, right? But they are because they're a national broadcaster. Either way, I think they're right. He is, he is kind of an idiot. Joe Namath says Mark Sanchez is a better quarterback than Tim Tebow. That's right. Uh-oh. And then he said this. I want to kiss you. I couldn't care less about the team struggling. And he went back to his uh, his bottle. I like Joe Namath. He's a, he's a classy guy. And uh, Sunshine Girl Crystal likes social networking like MySpace and stuff like that. What do you think of uh, Sunshine Girl Crystal there, Torts? No, I'm going to keep it in the room. How about you, Berkey? I think it's an ignorant question. And a gutless one, too. They won't even comment on the Sunshine Girl. My God.